Hello guys, this is GeeSquad16, welcome back to Let's Replay Banjo-Tooie. Uh, let's go ahead and do some more exploring for Floor 2 and then we'll move on to Floor 3. And yeah, quick, why am I slipping off the Z button? I don't know why. Okay, so let's see, is there anything in here? I think I think over there is another battery. I'll be coming back and getting that later. Well actually yeah, I'll be definitely getting that later. I think that's one of the last batteries I'm actually gonna be getting. To open up the uh, the uh, last uh Jinjo door. Uh, uh, battery operated door, not Jinjo door. I don't know what's going on with me right now. But anyhow, let's actually go over here. This right here will create a shortcut from the room with the tin tops back over here. Back to over this area right here in floor 2. Another bunny right there. Can't do nothing with him. Okay, so now we need to grip grab our way across this uh, area here. Up this ladder. And we'll be on floor three. Now for those of you who are wondering what kind of factory this is, it's an underwear factory. So yes, they create they create, they make big old pants, uh, underpants. So yeah, I never heard of that brand. I guess it's only exclusive to England. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. I'm just having a little fun with you guys. So yeah, big go pants. Okay, there should be... Uh, I'm going to show you guys something here. Get away from me. Okay, over here. Boiler plant. Let's check this out. What the? Oh, we can't go through there? Yes, apparently the only way we can only go through here is if we're disguised as a, if we're a mechanical personnel, which we're not. We're just a random barren bird that just stumbled upon a factory, which is which is a world, and uh, here to stop a bony witch, the, a bone witch, witch that's covered a bony witch. That's what I was trying to think. A bony witch that. Uh, that uh, killed our fr good mole friend. So, okay, so there should be a box around here that should say something. And it's actually, a cameo for a famous movie. It may sound crazy, but if I can find it, okay, so no, it's not the junk, and it's not the one that says big old pants. Okay, there's a there's a globo over there. Yeah, the reason why I don't like this world, it's kind of boring, if you would. but that's just me, and plus it takes the longest time to complete this world, because you're going back, and, well, there's just a lot of, there's a lot of stuff to be taken care of. There's a Globo right there. We use for Mumbo, and yes, uh, Mumbo Skull is here on floor three. But... Um, I'm actually going to do this real quick before I split up. Yes, we're going to split up again. You're going to be doing a lot of splitting up in this world here. I should go ahead and mention that. And we'll shoot fire. Okay, there should be a way to get up here. Okay. There's actually something up here I want to get that's important. And I can't jump that far. Nope. Okay, I have an idea how to get there. Okay. Excuse <laughs> Okay, and there's the boiler plant. Not gonna go in there just yet. Okay. Okay, that's what I wanted. That's the way I like it. No, I'm not gonna sing the song. Thank you very much. 
This song that goes, that's the way, uh huh, huh, I like it. I'm not gonna sing it. Okay, over here in this box, there's an empty honeycomb, so. Okay, yeah, I just wanna see where I'm going. I need to climb up this pole because something important. A couple of notes are up here. And over there, that's, that's a Minjo, so. So, yeah. So, yeah, I cannot believe we're in an underpants factory. Yeah, just, just, just we're in an underpants factory, folks. That makes big old pants underpants. Okay, so now I'm going to split Banjo and Kazooie up because I'm going to get a battery that's in here. Which is right here. And we're going to use it to open up another one of the doors. Yeah. Okay. Let's see, now I need to figure out how you can get up here. Okay, there we go. Use the double jump to get your way up here. Okay, so now we're going to go into the boiler plant. This is where we're going to take the battery to. Because in here, in the boiler plant, is another battery op operated door. And, buddy, will you get the frig out of here? I don't care what you are. I don't know if you're Royal's brother or cousin. I don't care. You just need to leave me the hell alone. But anyways. So yes, uh, so now we can open that door. We'll actually need Kazooie for this. Actually, gonna need Kazooie right here. Can't quite make it up there. But we'll just do it this way. If if my control stick won't stop acting up, uh, I'm using a new controller, by the way. I got a new controller last weekend, and it's um it's one of them classic controllers that old vintage video game stores sell. It's brand new. It's like a retro controller, pretty much. So, see, I've been using it. Going pretty good for me right now. If I don't quit running, if Kazooie doesn't quit running into the walls. Okay, so now we're gonna go into the packing room. Not a mini game right here. Frankly, packing challenge has been located. Game rules are available if required. Uh, no, I don't know. No, I don't need to play this. I'll. Well, I don't need the instructions. Okay, so basically, here's what we need to do. We got these little twinkies right here, and we need to get each of these right here. These twinkies here that are different colored, and each of these are you. Pretty much you guessed it, there are different point values. The green the red ones are worth one, green two, and blue are three. Now remember, the more twinkies you carry, the slower you get, so So yeah, go to the packing chute right here, and you can unload them right here. Now I believe the go is forty-five, I think it is, or forty-eight, and maybe fifty, I'm not for sure. So yeah, if you can get a lot of greens and blues, you should be fine. Okay, let's start unloading. Oh wow, I'm actually not going to make this. Ah, dang it. Yep, I failed. Check and loader stock. Packing effort shown in... Ah. Ah, I don't have to do this again. Dang it. I don't hardly fail at this, but it's probably this new controller I'm using. Okay, so yeah, you gotta grab the turbo trainers here, so. Get the. There we go. Now I slipped off the control stick that time. My thumb did. So yeah, when you feel like you're starting to go slow and slower, it'd be a good opportunity to uh, 
unload your uh, your uh, your your stash or stock, whatever. That was pretty good. That was a pretty good run right there. But oh crap, I'm not running out of time again. Okay, come on. Forty. Made it! There we go! Did it! Okay. Packing requirements have been met. A bonus will now be awarded. And there we go! Now we get a jiggy after two attempts at this packing room game. And... No, I don't want to play again. Because we are done in here. That's only the second jiggy we've gotten in this world. Yeah. This, the jiggies in this world are actually pretty much scattered out. Well, for the first couple of floors, but once we get up to later floors, they'll be right there. And I'll explain one of them here in just a minute. But for right now, there's a little uh, platform here with four nuts. Well, four bolts or screws. Screws. So build drill. And you will unscrew them, and that this one will let go of some chains that have chains. That has a mumbo pad, so. Just keep on doing this. And there we go. You can now use the mumbo pad, which we're actually gonna get mumbo right now, actually. So we can so he can do his thing. Okay, over here we have a uh, door right here. With a button, the speaky bar that button, and we'll open this door, which will lead to the elevator shaft. It's kind of a useless room right here because all it does is take you from different floors. Because this elevator here is broken, and if you want to go through here, but it's kind of useless though. Useless room. So, so yeah. So now we're gonna, like I said, we're gonna get we're gonna get Mumbo and do his thing. It's actually the and um yeah. Shut up, camera. You can go blah blah blah. Yes, I did say blah blah blah. Okay, Mr. Mumbo. You may think um, we're in a factory and you think Mumbo's going to be a worker. Well, a mechanic, right? Well, no. Since this is since this is Grunty's factory, Mumbo is actually going to be the opposite of a mechanic of a factory. Yes, I work in a factory, folks, and we have uh, mechanics that actually work on the machines if they're broken down. So yeah, Mumbo is actually going to be the opposite of that. He's going to be the destroyer. I guess you could say kind of a destroyer. So we're going to go back to floor two. We're going to actually go into the electromagnetic chamber and we can use the mumble pad there. Okay, can we bust this? Oh, yes, we can. We can break that door open with Mumble Zap Stick. Okay, in here, so now let's actually see what Mumbo has spell for us here. What Mumbo's spell is for Grunty Industries. Okay, so here we go. Okay, so he has the EMP, which is Electromagnetic Pulse. And what that does, it'll actually temporarily disable a piece of equipment in Grunty's factory. Magnet malfunction. All friction program initiated. Magnet will be reactivated in 90 seconds. <sighs> okay, so now we got 90 seconds to take Mumbo back, so take Mumbo back to his skull, and um, get Banjo and Kazooie back, and then use the Walmart transformation to push down that big button. But you got 90 seconds, so I recommend. So I would highly suggest. It's a reckon it's a must that you must take that shortcut from the electromagnetic chamber back to this warp pad right here. 
because it'll actually save some time for you. So, because without that, you're probably not going to make it back to Mumbo to uh, to the big to uh, Mumbo's and then back to Wamba, then back to four two to Wamba's and then to the electromagnetic chamber. So we can push the push the big red button. Okay, so next stop is Wamba's wigwam for the transformation. Okay, so there's there's one good thing because uh, whenever you talk to other characters or go into other areas, the timer will stop. So, so yeah, that's a good that's a that's a biggie. Okay, guys, here is the transformation for for Grunty Industries, and it's the washing machine. One I call this washer. Use control stick to move. And press Z to fire plenty underwear. <laughs> I love that quote. Okay, so now we're gonna use the washer washing machine or washer, whatever you want to call it, to push the big red button. Yeah, because we still got a lot of time left. Because um, you know, if you know where you're going and you do it just right, you'll still have plenty of time left over. All right, let's we'll see what this is gonna do. It's gonna open something in the basement air conditioning plant, and it will open the door to the repair depot. But we're actually not gonna go there right away because that area is back in floor one, going toward the basement, going in the basement. So, so yeah, um, so it's gonna be near the end whenever I'm back in there before we investigate what's inside the repel depot okay so now I'm going to explain the washer here his only attack he yes he shoots out underwear yes he shoots out underwear you just press the Z button now there is something else we're going to do with the washer but we're going to actually change back into Banjo and Kazooie and go to the next floor so but we'll be using the washer later on so but it'll be much later before we get back to the washer. I just used the washer because you have to have the washer to push the red button down, so. Okay, um, I think we're done and we're floor three for right now. Okay, I believe we're ready to go to floor four. Oh, shut up. Go beat, beat, beat to your mama. Okay, so now let's, uh... Okay, this is where we need to go, actually. Right over here. Oh, wow, I didn't get shocked right there. Thank God. Okay, I think we're... Through, yeah, floor three. Okay, so here we are in floor four. Over here we have another one of those doors right here. Now there's one thing I'm gonna do right in here. Okay, I can't. I have to do that. Okay, so right in here we have wall crushers, and that is not, and that we cannot make our way through there because because we're not fast enough to make it through there. Because if we get crushed, we're actually going to get squashed. We get squashed. So if you haven't guessed it, if I don't fall off. Yes, we're going to need Mumbo once again in here. But we'll do that later. But for right now... Um, I'm, there should be... Yes, right here. There should be a switch. A fly pad switch. 
And that will activate flat pads around the area. So now we can actually go flying around Grunty Industries. But I'm actually going to go ahead and end the video here, folks. Um, so join me next time on Let's Play, Let's Replay Banjo Tooie. If I don't get killed by the Ten Tops. Uh, so join me next time on Let's uh, Replay Banjo Tooie. We're actually going to go outside of Grunty Industries and we're going to do some flying around. So, so yeah, till then, this is Geese Quest 16 signing out. Later.